Hi, everybody. How are y'all? I am Frugalistic Lupus Sister. I am in the kitchen, as you probably can tell. Well, you're probably looking at the ceiling, but I'm in the kitchen trying to cook. Um, I'm feeling, I am feeling a lot better because I am cooking. Um, and I'm cooking healthy. I'm really cooking healthy today. My husband and I decided that we are going to eat healthy. So that's what we're going to do. We are going to try to cook. New year, new us. That's my little one. Can you, t- can you tell she's almost 20 and she looks as if she's 12? She's the one that I was telling you all that has Reynolds. That's my baby. But yes, I uh, am in the kitchen. I'm cooking. And we also are doing meal prep. So that's what I'm actually doing. Um, I, I am feeling a lot better. I just make sure I continue to take my medication. I want to make sure that. But today, I don't know. I was um, walking in a store today and my, I think it was my hip. I felt as though it was going to give out on me. I thought I was going to have to fall to the floor. But it's all good. We are. I don't know. Where's the doll? She's not upstairs? I called her name. She wasn't upstairs. I threw the ball and she didn't come downstairs to get it. She's we not can't. Sure is we don't know where the dog is. We can't find the dog. We lost the dog in the house. <laughs> um, go check my room. Hold on. She's probably on my uh, couch in my room. She better come out. No, she didn't go outside. Had to... Check in my room. Well, yeah, her room. Luna is MIA, y'all. I mean, make sure we find her. But, yes, I am um, kind of meal prepping. So that's one way that we can eat healthier and also save money. So I can eat out a lot. So my husband um, gets home late sometimes. And by the time he gets home, you know, it's kind of late to... Um, to cook, so I go and try to prepare something before he gets here. But I am um, feeling better. Uh, I'm trying to fight off a cold. Oh my gosh! But um, so this I'm going. I'm um, trying to. Do. My husband and I both have like the sniffles, and I have to speak at my mom's church on Sunday. So it seems like every time I have to go to her church, I catch a cold. Isn't that something? Hmm. Yeah. But I am actually cooking i've cooked um thus far i did like some flank steaks so i'm gonna slice these up which i can show it to you better um i have some quinoa and chia seeds and rice in here you found the dog she's under the bed with this but now she won't leave from under the bed whose bed is she underneath yours we found her she won't move she's being you know, I know what to do. And then I have like some um, diced chicken breast here with some seasoning on it. And now I'm making some chicken strips. And I have mashed potatoes, which we do not need mashed potatoes. Uh, but I need some vegetables, some green vegetables, something. I will try to find some green vegetables in there. But that's what we're doing. She's trying to find Luna and get Luna down here. Luna knows she's in trouble. So, but I just want to say, hey, I'm doing a lot better. My palpitations are better. Yay! And I want to make sure that you all are good. Uh, My mom had called me the other day and a friend of hers at her church has a friend. Also, uh, her daughter has lupus. Her daughter is, I think she said 31. So I called the mom because she wanted some encouragement because her daughter is going through a flare up. But while I was talking to the mom, um, she also stated that her daughter had sickle cell. So she had like a double whammy uh, with the deal with the sickle cell and um, lupus. So I have been trying to encourage you. This, I guess this is just what I am called to do, even though I go through a lot of things. But I am here to encourage people. So that's why I'm actually going to talk about Sunday when I go to my mom's church. It's just to encourage people. 
and not to get weary in whatever you're doing. And in all things, just be thankful. So that's what I want to talk about and um, just share with people. You see this here? I had shoulder surgery. I um, I had a tear in my, um, my gosh, my, I had a torn labrum. So I was trying to um, take golf lessons. And um, I was out there and I tore my labrum. So I had two surgeries in my on my shoulders here. And when I tell you that surgery was horrendous, I kid you not. It was tough. It took a while for me to recover. But you guys are great. Just want to say hey, pop in, let's know that I am on the kitchen. Not on the kitchen. I'm in the kitchen cooking. Have you guys ever tried this here? Well, it's better than bouillon. It is um, organic. And I use this sometimes instead of... um like butter or anything like this. This is like a, a broth. It actually give a flavoring to your chicken and it's a roasted chicken base with made with seasoned from roasted chicken meat. So it's organic. So if you have tried this, let me know because it is good. I am like almost out. So I use this to put in my little, which I can show you guys when I'm cooking. What well, part of it? Let me see. Hold for a second. So this is what I'm cooking. And I didn't put anything. The only thing I put in here was some of uh, that, better than bouillon, a little water, and I did some poultry seasoning. And this is all that we're going to have. So this is going to be some, like, chicken breast strips from our husband. I have the chicken breast actually diced up over there. So we're going to have, like, a meal. And this is going to last us for the week. Okay. Okay. So I just want to say, hey, you guys are truly great. Because if I'm in the kitchen cooking, I feel better. If not, I just had to push it because I did promise my husband that I'm going to cook for him. And that's what I'm going to do. But after I get through cooking, I'm going to go upstairs and sit it down because I'm tired. But you guys, thank you all so much. Much love. Bye.